Hey everyone, in today's video, I am going to show you how to fix the missing Enroll Now button for ESU, which stands for Extended Security Updates, on your Windows 10 update page. If you are trying to get the free one year extended security updates, but that button is not showing up, don't worry. This usually happens when Windows doesn't automatically display the enrollment option even though your system qualifies. The good news is, it's a quick and easy fix and we can get the ESU Enroll Now button back in just a few minutes. Let's get started. First, you need to check if your Windows 10 is eligible for the ESU program. To do this, press Windows plus R to open the run box. Type Winver and click OK. Here you will see your Windows version and OS build. Make sure your version is 22H2 and your OS build is 1945 or higher. Next, go to Accounts and check whether you are signed in with a Microsoft account or a local account. Only Microsoft accounts are eligible for ESU, local accounts won't work. As you can see, I am signed in with my Microsoft account. If both of these requirements are met, then you can get the ESU Enroll Now button instantly. If your Windows 10 doesn't meet these eligibility requirements, first update your Windows to the latest version and make sure you are signed in with a Microsoft account. Once that's done, follow these steps to get the ESU Enroll Now button. So go to your Windows search bar and type here regedit. You will see registry editor at the top of the result. Run it as administrator. If it asks for permission, click yes to allow. Once it opens, go to view and make sure the address bar is enabled. If not, click on it. Now you have to go to the windows path. I will provide the exact path and all necessary key name in the video description. So you can just copy and paste it here. So copy this whole path, go to the address bar and paste it here then hit enter now you can see here i have a folder named consumer esu this is exactly what we will need if it is not showing on your computer don't worry watch the video carefully if the consumer esu folder is present in your regedit but you are still not getting the esu enroll now button then maybe the value is wrong in the right hand side keys so we will delete the consumer esu folder right now and then create it in the right way so that you will get the enroll now button now copy the consumer esu folder name from the video description go to the windows folder right click on it click new then key and paste the folder name you just copied hit enter to save now on the right hand side we will create the necessary keys containing values copy the esu eligibility key name from the video description right click here in the blank space then click new and select d word 32 bit paste the key name you just copied and hit enter after that you have to set the key value double click on this key and you can see the value for this key is 2 so type 2 here and click ok now you have to create another key copy the second key name from the video description which is esu eligibility result and again right click here in the blank space click new and select d word 32 bit paste the name you just copied and hit enter to save for this key you have to set the value 1 so double click on this key enter the value 1 and click ok to save congratulations we have created the esu program folder and keys in the right way close regedit click on the windows start button and restart your pc Once your PC restarts, click on the Windows Start button and then click on Settings to open it. Once it opens, go to Windows Update. Now you should see the ESU Enroll Now button appear. By clicking on this button, you can easily extend your Windows 10 security updates for free for one more year. And that's it, your system is now ready and fully enrolled in the ESU program. If this video helped you, make sure to like, share and subscribe for more Windows tips and tricks. Thanks for watching and I will see you in the next one.